All right, guys. So look at springs. Your Honor, it's good as wish to launch his satellite. She'd be happy to help. Click to continue. How can I back out? No. Resume. <laughs> Springs the mechanic. The new operator of Scooter's Garage is a master mechanic who recently relocated to Pandora with her girlfriend Athena. After getting Athena captured and then asking her to build us a rocket, we probably owe her some favors. What's one more? Okay, luck went through physicality, black belt, personality, sunshine vengeance. Yeah. Felix. Felix the inventor. Conman, thinker, father figure. Despite orchestrating the wall key deal that got us into this mess, Felix has always been the guy with the plan. We just didn't part on the best of terms. Taste will you find? Symphony Fantastic. <laughs> You warn Felix about the bomb inside the Imperium case, he's alive and ready to make amends. Okay. So we have to choose three more people? Ah, Athena is there. And August. Look at. What? You didn't save enough money to pay for the Vault Hunter's exorbitant fee? Ah, this is just a random Vault Hunter or what? I found someone new. He's experienced, but it looks like he's more than we can afford. Who was it? No point in saying. You'd just be disappointed. Uh. Okay. Just, uh... Just any random vault hunter or what? Definitely looks like August kinda, but okay. Cassius? Man, this, this guy was kinda okay, weird. Okay, I know this is random, but what about Cassius? The sign. Seriously? Clearly the guy has a couple of screws loose. Last known Atlas employee, though the years he spent in isolation have taken yes, a... Yes, I know, but maybe a crazy scientist is just... Yeah, but he also kind of saved my life. That's cool, right? Have taken a toll on his sanity. Cash's wealth of Atlas secrets and knack for invention could be highly valuable in any combat scenario. Maybe don't mention his cat. You prevented Tina from killing Cash. She feels he owes you a favor and is really willing to help. So how many people do we have here? Springs is kind of cool, I guess. Tina is definitely zero. Zero. I definitely want zero at my side here. Ah, uh, there is August. I suppose there's always August. August the Brawler, son of Valerie and proprietor of the Purple Skag. August spent the majority of his life stabbing, shooting and punching his way up the ranks of Hollow Point's organized crime scene. He might be a little unstable, but he never turned down a good deal. You sold out someone other than August for the botched vault key deal. He respects your restraint and will help. Oh, I can see this is just a random guy over there, but this is nice. I've got so much money and I could afford the most expensive van design, yeah, and the zero I will definitely take. He is <laughs> with his fucking sword. The assassin, an infamous assassin shrouded in mystery, we most recently crossed paths with Zero in Death Valley where he killed Bossa Nova and the majority of spectators. There's a good chance that news of a new world might lure him out of hiding. You identify yourself as a vault hunter to Mordecai. Word of this reached Zero and he is interested to watch you in action. Select him. Wow. Athena. Okay, a living legend. 
the gladiator. Athena's experience in talking down vault guardians would be extremely valuable. Despite the fact that she was last seen being dragged away by two vault hunters, it's doubtful that anyone could keep her captive for long. You learned quickly under Athena's tutelage. She recognized your skill and will be your ally once more. Uh, do I want her? Yeah, of course. <laughs> Yeah, this means we have a laser, we have a fucking shield. Cajus is kind of weird, August is kind of cool. But I just want Felix at our side, guys. Select. Team 4. Confirm squad. How long I shouldn't have trusted? Hey. So there were no other instructions? Yes. Yes. What? Yes. Yes or yes no? You confuse me. If there are other instructions, what are the other instructions? To wait here for further instructions. Cool. I do not understand why you are angry. Uh, maybe because I bought the most expensive van design. Fiona, my dear. Another echo con. The coward has to leave a recording. Actually. This is a live feed. Oh. I altered the echo calm to receive the signal. See? I'm waving at you. You can see this, can't you? Why aren't you here? I thought you were going to help us. To be honest, I wasn't sure I'd be able to get a word out before you shot me. You have a history of that. I need you to know I did not betray you. It was all simply part of a longer con that had some minor complications. It was always in the plan for it to look like the money was burned to bits. It wasn't in the plan for this armoire to be blown out of the back of the caravan and end up sitting in the middle of the desert. What are you getting at? Open the drawer. Uh-huh. You see how much cash I have? Almost 2k? Maybe I'm just missing 30 of those Pandarian dollars. Man. A drawer in the middle of the desert. <gasps> that is a lot of dough. Dough? I can see another name for... The drawer contains 9 million dollars. Oh man! I expect you to split that money with your sister. And make sure she doesn't blow it all on guns. How did you do this? When the caravan crashed, you were out cold for a bit. That's when I disarmed the Hyperion explosive and swapped the real money for fake. Then rearmed the bomb. It needed to look like the money was gone and you had nothing to do with it. Valerie, Hyperion, they would all be after it and I had hoped that I could draw their attention away from you. See the money go and be able to blame me for it. Obviously, things did not work out that way. But I failed you. Had I planned things more thoroughly, this could all have been avoided. You could have included us in the plan. We trained our whole lives for a score like this. I needed you to be able to honestly say, under harsh questioning, that the money was gone. We wouldn't have broke. I believe that, but it wasn't worth the risk. Now listen to me. That money will not solve everything. But it will get the both of you out of your life now, and into one of your own choosing. The con game, it's not for you. Not because you aren't good at it, but simply because you deserve better. You should have a life where you aren't lurking in the shadows, afraid of being recognized, afraid of being found out, of retribution. I don't know. 
The list of people looking for us has only gotten longer since you went away. Probably need to keep a low profile. People will always come looking for you, Fiona. But in the future, it won't be because you're on some wanted poster. It will be because of the great things you've done. You are destined for so much more. I'll be in touch. Give Sasha my love. Wait, no! Damn it. That is nice of Felix to leave you the money, but we are still short one team member. Please select a replacement team member. Oh, now I have enough cash, right? Mystery Vault Hunter Springs Caches, of course we take a look now. I guess we can afford the mystery choice now. Yeah. I love surprises. Oh, That's I... W settled. Let's go get our team. Yeah, I was kind of a little bit disappointed because I didn't... Just wanted to take a look at that mystery choice. And now we can do it. <laughs> Good thing that we had Felix in our team. What's, where's the missing one? you were looking for the Gordas Core yourself. Well, that was before. I've abandoned that mission. My queue was too full. I've been there. They really start to pile up. Thank you for coming. Sure. I'm mostly here for the loot. Isn't Sasha supposed to be here for this? <sighs> Relax, she will be. She's rounding up the vault hunter we hired. We'll catch her up when she gets here. All right. So, in order to access the mysterious treasures of the vault... Ahem. ...and assure the safety of Gordas, we gotta destroy the monster that protects us. This is the Traveler. It's quite impressive. That's the largest vault monster I have ever seen. Oh yeah, it's big. It's nasty. It's gotta go. To make matters more fun and complicated, it teleports. Yay. Hence the whole traveler thing. That thing looks heavily armored. How do we deal with that? Oh, yeah, it is. Yeah, it's actually impossible to penetrate. That's why you and Sasha have to get inside. When the traveler teleports, there's a swirl of energy at the point where it's gonna jump to. You just have to time it so that when you get the caravan... The caravan? Yeah, that's what I said. It flies now, remember? You just gotta time it so that you're inside the energy thing when the monster shows up. What little information we were able to gather seems to point to a gland, tucked in its giant tummy there, as the source for its teleportation abilities. Once you're in, you wire up the gland, weird to keep calling it that, with explosives. Trigger the remote detonator and get the heck out of there. So what's everyone else's role? Good question. 
the B team, that's you guys, and whomever this vault hunter for hire is. You're saddled with the unenviable task of drawing the monster over to this area. You get the monster toward the vicinity of this ledge, it tries to jump into range. The caravan flies into the energy swirly thing before it jumps. So, <laughs> where do I fit into all of this? You, sir, are our motivational speaker. After the teleportation is offline, we need Gordas to wrestle the Traveler into place for the Moonbeam. And that's gonna require some convincing. And that's what you and Loderbot are in charge of. Well, I guess... I guess this is what we're doing. Well, sounds good to me. At least, what I heard of it. Oh, new look. I... I thought you were dead. <laughs> Get over here! Oh, oh, come on. <laughs> you know I would... You, uh... Just <laughs> so happy to see you. Keep fun, ah! safe. <laughs> yeah, me too. Oh, yes, I saw that. Oh, hey. It's, um... It's good to see you, Reese. Like the new hair. Whole... Look, it works. Oh, thanks. Oh, but to be clear, is that a compliment from Reese or Jack? Right. Well, to be fair, Jack would have phrased it differently. I suppose you're right. All right, all right, enough of whatever the hell that was. What happened to the Vault Hunter you were supposed to bring? Right. Uh, okay. Um, about that... Oh, I can't believe you crashed Helios! Eh? Huh? That's Who said you could do that? Zero is... Disappoint. Well, turn that emoji frown upside down, buddy. Things are about to get awesome. What a crew you've got assembled here. It's a good thing you hired me. You could really use the even-keeled professional temperament I bring to the table. So what's your refund policy like? There are absolutely no refunds, returns, or exchanges. All sales are final. Also, I already spent the money. There's nothing left. I made some terrible decisions that, in the moment, felt awesome. So, uh, if there's some sort of win bonus or something, that'd be great. Otherwise, I'm gonna need a ride home after all of this. Whoa! Wait a sec. Is that the monster we're fighting? <laughs> this is a suicide mission! We're all gonna die! Don't you see? What the mm, fuck? Fine with her at this point. This is the mysterious Vault Hunter. Oh my god. Alright guys, Moonbeam is fully charged. We're ready here when you are. She is ready. The only missing pieces are you two. What now? We bring my friend back. I could not revive her myself. I require your help. You two are still imprinted on her core. It must be made whole again. That's all it takes this time? I've made some modifications. You will want to stand back. This may not be pleasant. Um... It is not working. My disappointment is palpable. Uh, did I put it in backwards? Uh, backwards? I don't know, like, you know, batteries, I... <laughs> My has she grown 
have final form? Hey guys! What are you doing here? The Traveler, your journey ends here. Oh no! Not, Not again! <laughs> Get to your positions. We don't got a lot of time. Okay, Fiona and Sasha, they want, they're trying to get inside that huge thing. Breeze? What's going on? As glad as I am to see you all again. Hey, Gordis. Missed ya. Oh, me too. You bet we're probably gonna die, though. Okay, so here's the plan. You're gonna force the Traveler into position so Fiona and Sasha can get inside it and destroy its teleportation gland. Then Vaughn will use Helios's beam to destroy it. Got it? No. Nope. Oh, really? Which part? The part where we don't all get our butts kicked like last time. I thought I was ready back then, but I didn't stand a chance. <laughs> yeah, but uh, that 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 that's the plan. I can't believe we're doing this. Do we got this? We got this, right? Because I'm kind of driving us toward a really big thing that wants us dead. Hell, I feel sorry for the monster. All right, let's do this. Fiona, get to the top of the cliff. After we get the Traveler into position, you'll only have a few seconds to jump into it while it teleports. Just handle your part. We got this. Hey, that's our turn! I checked it out last night. She's solid for one last ride. Yeah, the only good thing Felix ever gave us. The caravan. I don't know. I'm pretty happy with my gun. You still got that gift Felix gave me? Of course I... Ugh. Whoa, that wasn't the plan. No. Uh-uh. Okay, so, I'm uh, I screwed up, please don't be mad at me. Ugh, Vaughn. Uh, I totally jumped the gun there. Uh, yeah. Vaughn! I know, I know, I just, I, I, I mean, I saw him walk right in front of the beam, I figured I could just end this all right now. Tell me we've got another shot. Yes, eventually. Wh what? You were supposed to wait until we took out the teleportation gland. Don't worry, I'll get it charged back up. We're fine. This is not a problem. Guys, I got a problem. Gordis doesn't want anything to do with this. Wh what? Awesome! Yell at Reese. I gotta go. She's scared, okay? I can't get her into position. Convince her! Look, Gordis, you can do this! Okay, it'll be different this time. We're all here together. Uh, excuse me? Sorry to f***ing interrupt, Gordis. Oh, man. But the traveler nearly squashed me. You know, just let you know, in case you're one of the few people who even gives a f But if we fight, we'll lose. Oh, I wish you all had just given up on the vault. That's why I had Fiona destroy me. I didn't want to put you in danger. I may be programmed to find the vault, but you're my friends. Gordis, we're gonna fight this thing together. All of us. But last time... Forget about last time. Your friends are all here, Gordis, and we can do this. Together. Well, if you say so. But you gotta drive. Drive? What are, what are you? What are you? No, 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 no! I don't know how to fight, so you should be in charge. You'll be great at it. Trust me. I believe in you. I mean, when you get right down to it, there's not much difference between a bandit and a skyscraper-sized teleporting monster. Gordis, can you give me a huge stun baton? Because I'm pretty good with those. I definitely cannot. Well, 
Until then, we're screwed. <laughs> I have no idea how to fight. I come from a place where people settle their differences with finger guns. Like this? Oh. Oh, okay. Let's do this. Hey, asshole! Gordis, can you get its attention? Hey, you! Big, freaky, Chloe! Big hand and handy thing monster! How was that? I mean, yeah, technically, you got his attention. <laughs> oh, we'll give him something to laugh about. He's already laughing! Well, yeah, yeah, but I mean, now we... You know what, just shoot! Teleport and he's there. You good? We're ready. Go! Go, go! I feel like you dropped a whole lot. Oh, it smells terrible in here. Huh. Guess there's no gravity in this thing when it teleports? I think I prefer zero G. Falling. Falling sucks. For a second, it reminded me of the ride to Helios. <sighs> well, let's not get too attached. We gotta blow that teleportation thingy up and get out. Grab the charges. We need to move fast. Who knows how long it's gonna take to find whatever makes this thing teleport. Okay, that's probably it. Of vaults and occasional teleportation clans? Guardians? There are aliens inside the massive alien. What the hell? Yeah. I know, I know, but we gotta get up there. Yeah, but how? Come on, we gotta get up! Reese, I love you, but please stop saying obvious things! Firing! Oh no, my finger guns aren't working! So let's just use the backup weapons! This thing's got other moves, right? Um, no. The only reason I could even fire the finger guns is because I learned it from you! I'm designed to scan your brain patterns for anything that'd be useful in a fight! Digi-adapted to my chassis. You learn attacks from your pilot? And, uh, Athena's got some sick moves. What about her? Oh, that's a great idea. Just imagine what Zero could teach me. Zero would... Oh, okay. Zero would uh, be in here? Oh, that's that's nice. Would he, would he sit next to me? Could he sit next to me? While Reese and Gordas engage the Traveler, we will do additional damage from its flight. Oh, okay. We are doing 
this now. Okay, Athena. The plan yeah, is for Gordas to digitize new attacks out of my combat experience. Got it. You're right. How did you? I'm good at my job, Reese. Let's do this. Oh, nobody's ever put me in charge of something so expensive. <laughs> you, sir, are almost certainly going to regret this. All right, Gordas. Let's go. Oh man, we have zero on Athena. Should should be enough skills for us. Doing now? Oh god, it's not working. Oh no! What? Time for zero. Okay. What is he? What is he doing? He's not doing anything. What is he doing? Um, yeah. I don't know. Oh, he did the thing! <laughs> he did the thing! You know? Who's got two big thumbs and just had his finger guns come back online? This guy. this thing until you pop its teleporting gland we can hold this thing off as long as it takes just hang on i'm almost there <laughs> as long as it takes i mean i suppose there's a chance they're friendly but it's nope. unlikely i'm open to ideas anything other than staying here and getting shot at we go in together that's the only way we make it through yeah why not if i'm gonna die might as well be with you Let's do it. Shit, the gravity. No, 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 this is perfect. I can propel myself straight to the core. Got my back? Always. Hey, we got this. Easy mode. 